things have gotten serious, again. Three of my friends are missing, and in order to get them back, we need to play and beat Euphoria. Euphoria. Because there are going to be four playable characters, get it? This one is by Sunsoft, and so the story is Bop Louie and his three friends slipped into a crater or something and ended up in a strange world, and he's separated from his friends. And I think they want to get back to Euphoria. So the game is named after the place they are from not the place they're going? I guess that explains the saga being in the title. And so, the saga begins. Bop Louie can't find his friends, and we're off. We can go left or right. Apparently I can't figure out the right way to jump on enemies, that's a shame. And when we jump Bop Louie into the water, he clearly has issues swimming. Probably needs to be unlocked, or a different character can swim, who knows, but let's go ahead and climb up this thing. Ah, uh, this game is going to be full of weird semi-kawaii stuff, isn't it? But it turns out you can jump on enemies, you just have to press down to actually get them. And then you pick up their dumb little faces and toss them. And then it's time for a big jump. Next, Bop Louie, you know, I'm just going to start calling him BL runs into his buddy Freon, but Freon doesn't remember BL, so naturally they're just gonna fight about it. Is that a, a knock on the door? I, I don't know anybody who can knock. Real Italian guy, are you here to help me play this game or are we going cannoli hunting again? Sorry about that. Oh, look, BL beat the guy. And he casually reminds Freon that he can swim and walk on ice. Well, that mystery is solved, and now Freon is joining the party. Hey, wait a minute. Hey, do you have your memories? Just the Italian ones. Do you maybe want to help me beat this game? Are we eating pizza in between scenes? You know it. Hey, I like his hat. I think it's actually part of who he is. And his jump sequence is cute. I'm glad this is a two-person team now, but where do we go? What's that box thing? Uh, Apparently it's a crystal, which will show us the password? Let's check it out. Uh, I've never seen a password like that before. It's giving me a headache. Using this menu, we can switch back to BL. I could really go for a BLT. Let's work on that later. We got two more people to find. Hey, check it out. Some water. Yeah, let me switch characters. Supposedly Freon does well with swimming. Yeah, he swims like I do. Oh yeah? Can you prove it? So who is this guy? I don't know, but Freon moves kind of slow, so I'm switching back to BL. When you land on his head, his mouth kind of looks like Rick. I can't tell if the head stomp or throwing the blue head things is what actually is hurting him, but eventually he's done. See you later, Euphoria Rick. And we unlock BL's secret weapon. It's kind of weird that this foreign land is where his secret weapon was found. Well, this is a saga after all. What does it even do? Uh, 
um that it it does that still waiting on those blts later oh wow this guy doesn't do well on the ice so let's try freon much better you ever see cool runnings of course jamaica's got a bobsled team you think we should go down the game seems to want you to look at this weird frog guy no thanks what do you think is in the chest over there? It's the map. Can we take a look? Reminds me of a map for something like Metroid. Does that make this a Metroidvania? And where are we on this map? I'd rather jump than answer that. Ah! No, really. Where are we? Well, if we work our way through this tunnel and hop in this minecart... I bet the trolls would love this. Then we can climb up this rope, do a hopscotch yonder ways, and now we are compass owners. And there we are on the map. So where to next? I was thinking we can try to find the next Euphoria character and make it into some kind of a trio. A, like Italian trio? Well, yeah. So, I mean, okay, what uh, what exactly is an Italian trio? Well, you got um, lasagna, you got the you know, uh, fettuccine, uh, linguine... Pasta Vazul, minestrone, like kind of like that. Okay. Tor, a tour of Italy, or are you talking more like <laughs> Buccelli, Pavarotti, Di Stefano? So wait, if you tour Italy, you just go to various places and you just keep eating those same dishes repeatedly. That's what an Italian does: eat, eat, wow, and eat. Okay, what do you think? What do you think BL wants to eat? BLTs. Yeah, well, but that's not part of an Italian trio. Yeah, it is. You got tomato. Okay, what about the bacon lettuce? So you know, bacon is could be pancetta. If you want to go that route. Okay. And we can do the bread as a ciabatta, uh, hmm. focaccia. I, I kind of agree with you. Um, and lettuce I'm, is lettuce. So. I'm pretty hungry now. Here's the next guy we get to fight and assimilate. Are you gonna, you know, fight us? Or just stand there and look cool? Do I really need to answer that? I wonder what ability this guy will have. Obviously, it'll be the coolest ability. Well, he's defeated, so let's see. And his name is Shades. Well, wasn't that fortuitous? Don't you mean something about foreshadowing? Dude, can you imagine having four shadows? That would be... euphoric. Anyway, Shades tells us we need to get to a temple, and there is a giant gate or something. Sounds like we might encounter some legends... of the hidden temple. Wow, this guy is really good. Wait, no, stop. Let's relax, David Shades Caruso. <laughs> that dude wishes he was as cool as me. So the Robinson Crusoe, what uh, what even is that? Oh, are you, are you talking about Robinson Crusoe? The yeah, shortstop for the New York Yankees. Oh, he is. Wait, you mean the guy who landed on that island with like his kids, and he had to like survive for like a few this, years, months? Are you talking about Swiss Family Robinson? Oh or, crap, that's not even close. Wait, is this Lord of the Flies? <laughs> not Lord of the Flies. <laughs> um, no, I mean, yeah. So, Hammer Time. Hammer right. time. MC. Let's yeah. go. MC hammer time. Can't touch this. <laughs> yeah. yeah. You can do two seconds. Look at how well you float. Of course I do. Yeah, but look how mad you get when you get hurt. Mad? Yeah, like your eyeballs go rah, 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 rah. See, that's why I got to switch to B. How do you see my eyeballs behind my shades? Good have, point. That well, is my good head point. dislodges from its body, so I'm able to see things differently. Yeah, you didn't think about that, did you? Touche. I wonder what this chest will have. Looks like it's a hammer. It's Shade's secret weapon. You know, the coolest one. What does it do? It seeks out multiple enemies and takes them out. I really wish we knew where to go to next. Well, this item should make that easier. So it's going to show us where all the items are located? Let's check the map. 
I guess we know where we are heading then. And maybe we'll find the fourth party member too. Do you guys have any good stories involving like trees or eggs? Or trees and eggs? Well, actually, you know how you go to a supermarket and you see white eggs? I do. I, I can't eat those. They remind me too much of ping pong balls. I can only eat brown eggs. But don't those just remind you of just brown ping pong balls? No, it just feels more natural. Okay. Well, I got a jumbo egg once and it had three yolks in it. Oh, so tr so like an Italian trio. Exactly right. Okay. You got it. Like a chicken trio. Chicken trio. Yeah. Did you guys ever get like Easter eggs around Easter time? No. They were all hidden. I don't believe in it. You don't believe in the eggs or you don't believe in Easter? I don't believe in rabbits. Oh, what if I found one and showed it to you? I wouldn't believe it. You would believe it's a, an illusion? I would believe that it's probably a ferret. Okay. I love ferrets. We used to have a ferret. You died at purple. You don't want to know what the name was. If a ferret could drive a car, how would it steer the car with a ferret wheel? Wow. Okay. This is supposed to be a weird, like, stretch for a Ferris wheel? I Does thought you were going to, like, talk about, like, what kind of car would the ferret be? What kind of car would the ferret be? That's a great question. Not a, not a rabbit, obviously. Yeah. Would he drive for Uber and deliver Italian trios? Of course. Nice. What is he doing with that egg? Uh, he's going to deliver it. Where? Actually, he's going to prove to... He's going to prove to the Shades guy over here that it exists. The rabbit? Do you believe in rabbit eggs? That I do believe. Okay, but as soon as they're hatched, they're not real. They're chocolate. Okay. Gotcha. <laughs> so, bro, what is your plan with the purple egg? I was planning to give it to this bird mama. Why? Because bird face lady will give us a lift to places including this battle against purple versions of the guy we fought before. I don't remember that. It was before your time. Doesn't seem like he's any different than before. Uh, did the previous version of this guy have his head floating around? No, this part is definitely new. Sounds like he had something on his mind. No, that doesn't make sense. Stop doing that. That's not okay. Once we beat him, we get this power up, which lets BL shimmy up the walls. That's cute. Check out this big gate. The message says it won't open without the keys. Any thoughts? Dude, keys open you know how gates. Keys work? You stick Did you even go to turn them gate to right. school? Usually Dude, left. it's right there on the yeah, screen. Open the door, man. Come on. Oh, yeah. Were you dropped it the, on your head as a kid? I think he was. Check out these shimmying skills. Mmm. Check out those lickers. Those mouths that are licking nothing? Oh, yeah. I think they are eternally searching for lollipops. Why do those clouds look like they're about to vomit? Because you didn't eat your vegetables. What if I told you I was a vegan? Then I guess you ate too many of them. Hey, what's the deal with that rock? Check it out, rock and roll, huh? Huh? Get it? Yes. Bruh. Be better. Can I borrow the shades? What? No! What was the point of blocking the water with that rock? By blocking the water, we now have access to this tunnel where BL finds his friend, Gil, and naturally we have to save him by fighting him. Are we expecting someone else to show up? Uh, I don't know. Seriously, though, is there a fourth guy coming? I I'm not kidding. I really do not have any idea. Bro, you must have someone else coming. Someone has conveniently showed up after every rescue character. Really mediocre storytelling, by the by. And so we knock out the guy, and now he's going to join us, and that's all there is to... Oh, it's just Trotsky. That's who you got Yo, for the fourth? I am not going to stand for this Travis. Yeah, take those off. Hey, these are prescriptions. Oh yeah, bro? Who's? Some guy. <laughs> Gentlemen. There's been a bunch of talk about keys? Yes, I'm hoping there will be one after we defeat this guy. Is he dropping off Teletubbies? I like his doofy face. But not his lasers. Is he going invisible or is that something with the video? No, he's really invisible. And now that he has been beat, it's red key time. I'm very happy for you. 
All right, so hear me out. What would life be like if you could breathe underwater? Like, what would you do? Does breathing underwater mean you're breathing the water? Uh, yes. Answer, I, answer it both ways. Huh. It's so tiring to swim for, like, half an hour as it is. I can't imagine breathing underwater and then, like, trying to get stuff done. You, you get, like, halfway through your day and just have to nap. Well, but consider this. Nobody would really drown anymore. We would have gills, correct? Sure. Or we like wearing like scuba diving gear and like living underneath the water for. Well, like... you can breathe under the. Oh, that's a good point. I guess the question. I, I guess you you don't you don't suffocate in the water. I guess would be the idea. You okay. Don't suffocate in the water. So the yeah. lower lower I go down, de- deeper the depths, I wouldn't crush to death. Oh, then. the pressure would still get you. Okay, so I would still die. So yeah. you still have to swim all the time, so you could stay during this near the surface. Unless you're just not too far down. Are you using your lungs or do you have gills? They're both. He asked before gills. Also, your name is Gill. Oh. Oh. Yeah. Nice. What Strange a... how the world works. Yeah. Didn't think we'd come full circle like this. So, would you be able to eat soup? I no. Wouldn't, I don't think so. Are you wearing a frog outfit? What is that? Uh, yeah, it's uh, something like that. Or is that like one of those little like fishes you see at the bottom of the ocean? Oh, when they bomb the depths, they have a little light hanging out from underneath the, over their forehead. It's his external gills. I think it's a Mario thing, like when Mario wears the raccoon suit. Oh, I see what you're saying. So he's in a suit. He's a really fast swimmer. Yeah. <laughs> well, that's because he can breathe underwater. Is he an anglerfish? Anglerfish. Uh, that's that's where he is. Yeah. They should add that to the Italian trio. <laughs> mm. Italian quattro. I can taste it already. Mm, taste the rainbow of quattro. So like for the quattro, they just have a light in front of you and then it sneaks up on you and you freak out? I guess so. Okay, how about this? Is cereal soup? Is what else would it be? Cereal? A stew? No, it's a soup. Okay, so if you go to a restaurant and they say, "Oh yeah, we here are today's specials," and you say, "Well, what is the soup of the day?" If they tell you that it's like Fruit Loops, is that acceptable? That is acceptable because it is, it is a substance a and a fluid, okay. which is what soups are. But isn't soup hearty though? Like, don't you want a nice hearty soup, not like sugary milk? To, as a soup, you know well, what I'm saying? Hawaiian pizza is still pizza, and that's still sweet. I will beg a differ, sir. Maybe oh, it's like a bisque. <laughs> but Hawaiian pizza is good. Is it a bisque? No, it's not thick Ooh. enough to be a bisque. Okay, it's got to be thick. Back to the, back to the Hawaiian pizza thing, thick. though. Okay. <laughs> that is very debatable. Is it? Do you put fruit on your pizza? Why could well, you? Tomatoes, tomatoes are, fruit. are also a tomato fruit. Tomatoes are fruit. That myself. <laughs> yeah, but you still put them in the vegetable aisle because you're not an idiot. <laughs> I heard once that... Knowledge is knowing that tomato is a fruit, and wisdom is knowing not to put it in your fruit salad. Uh, uh, okay. But back to this cereal soup, though. You really, really, really have a cereal soup question. Well, what about the Hawaiian pizza? Okay, question. What, what, uh, what pizza topping would you eliminate forever? Anchovies. Okay. Bacon. Bacon. Mushrooms. I only wanted one. Onions. I'm onions. so distracted by this guy that's in a diver suit that just like he it looks like he's just trying to survive underwater and you're jumping on him. Well, he can't breathe underwater. But every time you hit him, his mouth opens up and like looks like drool or something is coming out. No, 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 that's his regulator. Ah, uh, maybe he's. Wait till he hits him again. Wait. Oh, he died. Uh, oh, 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 never no, mind. No, can't do. Come it. on, hit him again. Come on, Mr. Froggy. Yeah. Boom. See right there. What's that? His regulator uh, comes out and it's like drool. Yeah. Huh. Yeah, we've seen that a few times before. Maybe he's not breathing air. Maybe he's breathing. Maybe he's like an alien and a monster that's breathing something else that's going to drool out in the water. And then they're toxic to the world. And, you know, Captain Planet might have to come and stop this person. Or you. Yeah, looks like we won. Nice. It looks like we got Gil's special ability. What does it do? Stick around and you might find out. There! Now you found out. He spits a glowy egg bomb? Indeed he does. You seem awfully proud of him. I am. You see, it was always my dream to one day spit glowy egg things. As a child, it was so difficult living in a world where one was so oppressed as to not be able to explode things and eat omelets. But Gil... Oh, Gil. He can do both, and I... I applaud him.
Why are we here? I just need to stock up on some health. If animals could talk, what would they say? Um, they would probably say, feed me? Who would be the rudest animal? Squirrels. Ooh. Squirrels? Definitely squirrels. Why? Because you always got their nuts. Oh. <laughs> I thought it was because they kept you getting in the road while I'm driving. No, actually, I take that back. The rudest animal would be a sandhill crane. They think they own the road. Oh, oh those yeah. things. Yeah. Their backwards knees pecking out your car. Ouch. Or maybe a seagull. Yeah. Seagulls are just so aggressive and angry and steal hot dogs. They're like birdie. They're like ocean eagles. Hot dogs? Sausages? Mm. Dual sausage? Is a hot dog a sandwich? Yes. Oh. Wait, what's with all these food questions? I'm hungry. Oh. We've been here for a while. Where are the BLTs? Actually, oh, that's a good question. They're with the Italian trios, probably. Lunch does sound good, and I do not want Italian. Okay. I'm offended, sir. Look at all that icing. It's snow. Oh, but now I want cake. Wait, did you just call it icing? Yeah, like, if you look that up, a bit Wait, wait, sweet. wait, 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 wait. That's not the issue here. You meant to say frosting. Okay, wait. here we go. Uh-oh, icing and frosting. Wait, there's a difference? Yeah, there's a difference. That's clearly frosting. Okay, well, as long as it's not, what is that, fondant? It tastes like I'm eating a newspaper. Oh. I don't even know what that is. That's like that weird stuff that go on the fancy cakes. You know what I'm talking about? You mean, like, that show where everything is cake? Oh, I don't know what that is. That is hilarious. Like, everything, that you see a uh, a doorknob and it's cake. <laughs> and, like, you, you, you're you trying to do something. And, oh, no, what you're trying to do, you try to drive a car and it turns out those steering wheels cake and you crash. What about, what about buttercream? <laughs> this is like a disease I want. <laughs> <laughs> is, is buttercream icing? or is that cream. Or is that frosting? I've never actually had that Ooh, before. You probably really? have, you just don't realize it. Oh. Because why would you, like... It's not like when you eat a cake, someone says, by the way, that's buttercream icing. Or cream cheese icing. Like, if somebody warns me about the type of icing, then I'm less likely to want to eat the cake. and be like, hey, just so you know, this icing has arsenic in it. Uh, yeah, that, that, that's not good. No, it isn't. So, like, rice and icing would just <laughs> not be something that you would like, Wait, even if it was the t- most tastiest icing you ever. You put rice in your icing? Rice and. Rice and. Rice and. Rice and icing? Rice and the... the Poison. Or what about rice The Geneva and Band, uh... Uh, anti-human chemical. Mm, rice and beans. <laughs> rice and beans. <laughs> What's he doing? Is that exploding? What's happening here? He's dropping frosting balls. Or is it icing balls? Uh, are they snowballs? Uh, uh, <laughs> bro, how many of these mini boss battles are there? Are you jealous that I'm using Freon instead of shades? Maybe. I like his outfit. I want to appropriate it. I like that he's blue. I'm so sorry. Like, in my head, that whole thing sounded good. But it just, it isn't. Oh, we finally get free on special attack thing. Okay. But what does it do? That. It does. It does that. Seems really cool. What's behind the stores of no interest to you? What is that? And what is it spitting? Spitting sausages? Live sausages? I hate it and I hope to never see one again. Dual sausage power! How's this for a fight? Metal armor? Using the head smash move seems pretty effective. I'm not sure I see the point of this fight. This. This is why you don't get to wear shades. Aw, don't be sad, kitty. I think you need to attack it. That seems mean. It's defenseless. Bouncing on it doesn't seem to be working. Try the head smash move. Huh, that seems to have worked. Where did your head go? It's just your body. Where we're going, we don't need heads. Oh!
V8, that would solve your problems. Well, according to the red text, we got the blue key. Okay, so these four guys, would we say that they make a good team? These four characters? They seem to at least have some kind of cohesion of being able to get the uh, platforming job done. A lot better than us, probably. What would you say the best four-person team is? Uh, Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles? Ooh, oh, TMNT? What about uh, the A-Team? A-Team? Good four. Yeah. I would say Kirby and his friends, although you may not know them. You know, the hamster, the fish, and the owl. I have no idea what you're talking about. I can't remember their names. Kirby with an owl? Like Kirby from Nintendo? Yes. And he's, oh, no, I'm not aware of this. I think it's Kirby's Dream Land 2. I really want to see the adult uh, mutant Ninja Turtles, you know, when they actually finally stop being teenage and, like, grow up and get jobs. And then it's like Raphael has a desk job and he's like, oh, I miss the days that I was beating up Shredder. So, So, like, adult normal employed tortoises? (laughs) Ghostbusters is also a good four-person team. Ah, that well, quick question, though. What, what is going on with this cat going up and down in this, like, tube? And uh, this snowball or icing ball or frosting ball going all around it? There seems to be a lot of games where you have characters regurgitating something else. Yeah, I mean, we all like to, you know, eat a lot of food in one episode. It happens sometimes. Is the cat evil? Or is the cat uh, trying to avoid the evil? You know, I I'd... think we're trying to kill the cat. Oh, Aww, poor kitty. Now it's unhappy. Yeah, he's really unhappy. How many of these green balls does it have inside that th- the thing? I think it's like one per hit or something. But uh, uh, there's a there's a density issue. I think the cat just kept sticking his head out because he's waiting for Uber to deliver his Italian trio. <laughs> or can we make it a quattro? Oh. oh. <laughs> we could give him a Hawaiian pizza. I'll take it. But I thought you hated Hawaiian pizza. I gave in when I found out that tomatoes are fruit. Okay. That works for me. I can't argue that. Oh, way to go, Gil. Green guy getting the green key. Maybe later we'll get some green tea. That makes three keys, right? Yeah, I'm hoping this gate is going to open. We did not choose to be the guardians of the gate, but there is no one else. What? what? Okay, so let's see who's it going to be. Oh, oh, it's that guy. He's the guy who, uh, this guy, he dropped out of school because he farted in his lunch and it made the teacher puke, and then he couldn't recite the alphabet. That was very specific, almost as if this happened to you before. No, it was a news article. Where? In my brain. You can, (laughs) that makes more sense. I was about to ask if you could read or not. Um, I can read hieroglyphics. I, I'm confused by his hat. I mean, he has all this other armor, but it, uh, he has a very har- heavily armored hat, but yet they don't seem to care about not have, have, having any things besides helmets. I mean, helmets are good. I think he had a, a, a gift card to a thrift store. Hot Topic. Is that a thrift store now? Uh, it should be. That, should, uh, that would be a hat at Hot Topic, though, like Viking extra spikes on top. I would expect like Hot Topping to probably just have him on a shirt. I would love to see a slingshot made that was made based on this guy that the arm is the, you know, you pull back with the little guy that gets shot out and then th- <laughs> is he, is he attacking us with his offspring? That That's what I was thinking. Case. Like what's going on here? Like little guys just flying out there coming back. Got to keep them separated. I feel like we had an episode <laughs> recently where the bad guys kept like spitting, spitting their own offspring out. I think was that Joe and Mac? I don't know. Mm, I could so go for some mac and cheese oh, and sloppy joes. Or some sloppy joes, yeah. Well, don't like mac, mac and cheese and, and sloppy joes mac as and a joes. mixture. Sloppy cheese. Sloppy cheese. <laughs> is, is there an unsloppy again? cheese? Oh, we should make our own pizza variant and call it the sloppy cheese pizza. Where like it's like four cheeses, but then when you the when they get the box, it's also got like a bunch of extra cheese on the outside just to make their hands messy, and they'd be like, oh. This pizza is a cheese pizza, and it sure is sloppy. The sloppy part makes it sound unappealing, but yet I don't feel that way about sloppy joes. Mm. I think that the health inspectors wouldn't like extra cheese on the outside of the cardboard box. We need that... a quartet of cheese. Oh, but if you had a sloppy joe and it wasn't messy, what would you what would you call it if it was just well organized? Just sloppy joe? Joseph, upstanding citizen Joe, upstanding citizen Joe. 
Immaculate Joe. Has his life together, Joe. (laughs) 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 Oh, well, he's done. What happened to his little guy? He's so happy about it, though. Yeah, he's like, oh, yay. I've been destroyed. He gets to go to Hawaii. Oh, he can go to Italy. For an Italian trio. That's it. There you go. (laughs) Quartet. Gentlemen, this was an experience. I agree. So what are you going to play next? Perhaps this team of four could stick around for a little while longer. You know, I think that's actually a great idea. Little Samson is next. See you all next time. What? Dude, why are you not waving? Did you, did you not learn how wave to wave? At the end of the episode. Did you go to wave school? Stop waving your beard. Put, yeah. put your hand down. Conform. I know you're thinking about burritos. Conform to waving. How, how many tacos are in your fridge? You're not wave. that much of a thinker. Hey, use your, use your hand. Can wave. You I can't believe this. Look what you did. Yeah. Did you know he's allergic to marshmallows? Thank you.